Welcome to the World Drum Market Channel. This is a connection testing video for the C20 gimbal. We are using the Skyjoy H16 remote controller, CUAV V6X flight controller, C20 gimbal camera, as well as 4 cables in total, including a LAN with POW cable, Polymer 1 cable, Xbox cable, and a power cable. From firstly, the C20 camera is connected to the H16 receiver using the LAN with POW cable. One side is connected to the network ports of C20 camera, while the other side splits into two wires for connecting to the LAN port of H16 receiver and the power supply. Secondly, the Telemo 1 cable is used to connect the output of H16 receiver to the Telemo 1 port of the flight controller. Next, a self made S Box cable is required which needs to be made according to the wiring sequence shown in the diagram. Please pay attention to whether the wiring sequence is connected correctly during the production. The 4P interface is connected to the S-Boss ports of H16 receiver, and the other side splits into two wires. One is a 5P interface connected to the S-Boss port of the flight controller, and the other is a power cable. Finally, power is connected to the gimbal, flight controller, and the receiver. The device connection is complete. Next, we will open the FPV in the remote controller to check if the connection control is normal. Copy the video stream address of the C20 camera from within the FPV for use in the later link inputs. Open Q ground control. And go to video settings to select the RTSP video stream. Input the video stream of the C20 camera. And the Q ground control will successfully display the camera image. Then Open the ground station of SkyDroid. Go to Settings and select the C20 camera to display in the left or right window.
The camera can also display image and control the direction. So, this connection testing is finished. Thanks for watching. Please follow us to watch more about the testing videos.